Hi everyone, today I'll show you how to use the PubNub Presence API with Swift. PubNub's core functionality is real-time PubSub messaging between users or devices. The PubNub Presence API provides an easy way to determine which users or devices are subscribed to your PubNub channels. In practice, you can use the Presence API to build a chat application with online status indicators, you can use it to monitor IoT devices that are functioning, and in a rideshare app, users can see which drivers are active. This Swift tutorial will show you how to enable the Presence functionality in your Swift application. Before you get started, you must enable the Presence feature for your API keys in your PubNub dashboard. By default, the Presence feature is disabled. Visit dashboard.pubnub.com to enable the Presence feature for your app. Presence has five client events that will fire for every subscriber in your PubNub key set. Join, Leave, Timeout, Set State, and Interval. You can register an event handler for each of these events. The event methods provide information like the user's UUID and a custom state object. When you initialize the PubNub SDK in your code, you can specify a heartbeat interval. Heartbeats are PubNub messages sent to tell PubNub a client is still connected. If a heartbeat message is not sent before the interval, a timeout fires for that UUID. Set state is an event that fires when a user's state is being set. All channel subscribers will receive the event. Interval is an announcement of how many users are currently in a channel. The interval event is an announcement that will be sent if the number of subscribers exceeds the announce max number. The announce max and interval values are set for an entire key set in your PubNub dashboard and not in client code. There are four accessor methods in the client SDK that allow you to ask for subscriber details like the members in a channel and their state object. The one mutator is a set state method that allows you to pass a custom object. Setting the user's state will fire a set state event to all subscribers. Here's a Swift playground with the PubNub SDK already imported. First, we create a PubNub client and manually set our UID. Notice that when you subscribe to a channel, you must set presence to be true. Next is a presence event handler that will print events to the console. When our user has successfully subscribed to a channel, functions will be called to print out our UUID, set the user's state, and then call the four accessor methods. Expect to see your UID print to the console, along with a list of which channels the UID is on right now. You'll also see a list of who is here right now for the given channel, a list of everyone on every channel, a state set event object for our UID, and the custom state for our UID. PubNub's presence makes online user information easy to obtain so you can build online user functionality into your chat applications, smart devices, or fleet management application. In the next video, we'll cover securing channels with PubNub's Access Manager and Swift.